everyone in this video let's check out the get ready with me series look number 2 for this festival season first i'm applying the aloe vera cucumber gel from the green leaf brand then i'm spraying the rose water allow it to penetrate and dry for 2 3 minutes Next, I am going to use a BB cream from the brand called Jovis. It's a saffron and very very green. Next, I am moisturizing my lip with a lip balm from Biotic brand. Next, I am going to apply Lakme Absolute Blood Perfect Makeup Primer. In last video itself, many have asked about the product used. I will try to share all the product links in the description box. Next, I am going to use Lakme Perfect Radiant Compact Powder, shade Golden Medium 3. With the fluffy brush, I am going to dab all around my face and over my neck. Next, I am using ADS Broke Pencil for my eyebrows. It is a waterproof eyebrow pencil. With this brush, I'm going to blend to have a natural look. So I have taken a shimmery purple shade as a transition shade. I'm also going to use this transition shade on my grease area and blend it all over evenly with the help of the medium sized brush. All the product used here is highly affordable rate so do check the description box to buy this product. Next I am going to use this dark pink waterproof eyeliner to achieve a pink eye shadow look. Roughly, I am going to draw 2-3 lines over my eye and I am going to blend it to get the purple pink eye shadow look. I suggest and recommend you all to invest on a good multicolor eyeliner. It helps me to obtain various looks and long lasting makeup look in highly affordable price. With the help of a medium sized brush, I am going to blend this eyeliner until my grease area. Next, I am going to take the purple shade from my eyeshadow palette and I am going to spread it little more on my eyelids. to use this Lakme Iconic Kajal as my eyeliner too. It is very easy to apply, lasts for a long time and very good at pigmentation too. Next, I am going to apply this as a Kajal, not so thick nor so thin in a medium line. I personally recommend this for all of you as it won't smudge very easily. Next from my Swiss Beauty blush palette, I am going to take a medium pink shade and I am going to blend it under my eyes to have an even look for my eyeshadow. From my eyeshadow palette, I am going to use a golden shimmery shade to highlight my brow bones. You can even use the highlighters to highlight your brow bones. Next, I am going to use a dark pink lip liner on the shade of 57 and I am going to use this as a lip liner along with that I am going to apply all over my lip as a Next, I am going to use my favorite Dazzler's Mascara. The brush of this mascara is too intense and we will get a good intense eyelashes. 
Next, I'm going to mix two three liquid lipstick to achieve the lavenderish pink shade. Today I'm going to use the lipstick from the brand called Matte Me. Over my pink lip liner, I'm going to mix two shades of pink, shade number 18 and 33, and I'm going to blend it all over with my fingers. As you can see, I have achieved two dark pink shades. I'm going to apply another shade from Matte Me brand, shade number 422 a grape wine shade finally i achieved a purplish pink shade for my lips i didn't have any purple shade blush palette so here i'm using a lavenderish pink color lipstick and i'm going to dab it on my cheeks on my cheekbone and i'm going to use this fluffy brush blend it to get the blush look finally in the brand called swiss beauty i'm going to use this bronze highlighter to highlight my face finally with the products available at my home i tried to create this purplish pink face makeup look let's move on to the hair setting i have a wavy hair when i wash my hairs and if i didn't use the comb i will have a natural curls to make it more curls i thought of having more curly look today so i'm going to use my curler here i'm using a curler from philips brand recently i got it as a gift on my birthday i plan to have a medium curl only at the base Outfit, I have just grabbed few stuff from my wardrobe. A black western top is paired with a pinkish white net skirt. And here we go with the final outcome. Video, I have shared some interesting tips how to use the product at your home and make your makeup in highly affordable price. For this look, I have used all my oxidized jewelry pieces. This oxidized jewelry kit enhanced my makeup look. This is very simple western jean top which has pearl work on it. I have paired that with the pinkish white net skirt and along with an anarchy dupatta. have enjoyed this video and got some ideas and tips how to use the makeup product available at your home and also to mix match your wardrobe i have planned to have a pinkish purple eye look for today stuff to get this classy elegant look If you find this video useful and if you are new to our channel, don't forget to subscribe and also press the bell icon for the notification.